Hello, true art believers, and welcome to today's live art stream. This is Pearson. I hope you are having a wonderful day. And it is day 362 of 400 Days of Drawing. And I'm going to be drawing Gengar. And I'm going to be sucking all the way while I'm doing it. I'm going to be sucking the whole time. Uh, because I am not that good. Anyways, <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm decent. I'm decent. I'm not great, but I'm decent. So we're going to be working on Gengar. I think we'll be doing um, finishing up the inks. And then we're going to add some color to it. Um, don't know what I'm going to do after that. I'm just going to kind of uh, play it by ear and I'm going to chat the entire time as I'm working on this. So without further ado, let's begin today's live art stream. And for those that are interested, I am using a brush called Sumi Clipped right here. It's it's kind of like an ink brush. So I've been using that because it's kind of got like a <coughs> kind of like a textured uh, a, appeal to it. So I've been using that for um, my drawing for the majority of this drawing, actually. So we're going to work on this character and then we're going to add some color and then we're going to go from uh, there. So we'll see what happens. It is day 362. Let's begin. Alrighty, I hope you're doing well. We're gonna zoom in here. Um, we're gonna zoom in. We're gonna do a little bit of screechy scratch. I just want to see what these marks look like before I begin, and we're just gonna kind of, um, I don't know. Um, oftentimes I'm just gonna kind of like make some marks here and there. Just gotta finish this area a little bit. Maybe add some marks here. Um. Yesterday, my gosh, man, I had a few bad days. It was a rough one for me. I uh, was at an exponential, like an existential art funk. And I need to really, I talked about this the other day. I was like, do I need to kind of, do I need, do I need to go back to my roots or go back to basics uh, on some, on some of these days? What should I do? Should I like, do like simple like studies? like art studies. I'm not, I don't know yet. I've been um, pondering it and um, I'm thinking maybe that might be the case. Maybe like two days of the week <coughs> I'm doing like fun stuff like Pokemon and doing my uh, cactus drawings. And then maybe the rest, like five of those days is me just doing like uh, maybe anatomy, figurative work, and then like basic studies, basic drawing studies like to really build up basic like skill building exercises you know and perhaps i need to sit down and think about that what i need to be doing with regards to that like because it's getting it's getting quite frustrating uh, quite frankly because i don't feel like i'm improving like i feel like i'm improving some but it's it doesn't feel nearly as quick as I'd like it to be, you know, and I've been doing this for a while. Uh, I got up early this morning uh, with the intent of doing some personal studies. Like I was going to study, do some like basically research and study and practice, like con concentrated practice. But um, I had a few things I had to do and uh, it kind of threw me off, um, and I just didn't get to it. You know, I didn't get to it, and so here I am doing this. So this is—I actually like this one. Um, this the way this one's going, the way that this this particular what's happening here. Uh oh, it looks like I'm having some glitching. You see that? You see that? I have some glitching going on. Um, Really? 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 Is that what you're going to do? You're going to do that to me? Let's save. Let's back out. Go back into it. There we go. What the? What was that? Photoshop, man. I'm paying I'm paying pretty top dollar for you, and you can't even get me a, a, a decent 
You can't, you can't, uh, you just keep glitching out on me. Come on, bro. Come on, man. Just don't do that, bro. Don't do that. Photoshop, you're, you're, you're uh, an expensive. I'm hearing, I'm hearing a lot of professionals are kind of backing out of Photoshop. And I can understand why, because, man, dude, what the heck? I was like, I'm doing nothing, doing nothing, and all of a sudden it glitches on me. Here I am. I'm glitched. And I think that is it for now. Not now. Uh, that's it for the, 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 um, the, <clears throat> that, the, 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 oh, please don't tell me I, uh, I drew all those inks on the wrong layer. Well, let's see. What layer is this? What layer is this? Yep, I drew it all in the wrong layer. So we're gonna, we're just gonna have to uh, merge them all. And we're just gonna merge. Merge these layers. Boom, merged. And what I've done is I labeled them inks final. So that's that's it. Oops. That's not. Actually, we should just uh, merge all of them. So what I'm going to do is... Uh, Right here, I'm going to go right here. I selected all these. So watch this. I selected them. Press, press shift, select, press the uh, second click, merge layers. And now that's it. This is all inks final right here. Now, whatever this is, what layer is that? There we go. Remove that. And we're going to go here, before we begin, we're going to go here, and we're just going to um, make a new group called Backup, put this here, we don't need to see it, what we need to do is um, copy this layer, so we have a copy, and we remove it, and we put it into Backup, and there we go, I have a backup file for all this stuff, and what I'm going to do now is we're gonna go like colors. That's gonna, um, <clears throat> we're gonna label, label them colors and we're gonna make another group. We're gonna call it, is it Gengar? Oops, Gengar? Hey, hey, come on, stop. Stop doing what you're doing. Don't do that. And I'm gonna put it here and we're gonna put this here so that, um, it's like this. So like when we collapse it, right? Now we have only two folders. So we're just I was just doing some organization here. Now I'm going to press control alt n shift n and that makes a layer right here. So you got a layer and we're just going to go like a uh, base color. Um we're going to call that the base. And basically what that's going to be, actually I want to do something first. Cuz I want to press E erase that there we go now so now what i'm going to do is we're going to basically color this purple right we're going to color it purple and then yeah, we're going to add the other colors. So um, I might make his teeth like yellow or blue. I think it might be cool. I don't know. I might do blue because the, the standard character is blue. But I think it might be cool to have a yellow, like give him like yellow teeth. You know, I don't know. I might add him blue. It looks like I'm going to add blue. You know, <clears throat> so that's what we're going to do. And um, here we go. I'm gonna get some purple here. Press B. We're not gonna use that brush. Don't 
Don't, that's too dark. I'm going to make it a little bit lighter. Still too dark. Hmm. I think what, it, yeah, we'll do like a, um, a mid, this purple. No, we'll go like a little bit darker here. Yeah, that's, it's going to be purple. He's going to be purple. There we go. We can always change this. You know, there's ways to do this. That I just, I, uh, like you can do like there's a Photoshop's auto select tool is apparently pretty good. Um, but I'm not, I'm not too familiar with it. So I'm just going to have to, we're just going to color it like this. I'm not even sure I'm using the right purple. Ooh, he's more like a maroon. I might do that. So we'll do we'll do maroon. Let's do that. Oh yeah, I think I might like that a little bit better. Cause he's it, like the character's purple, but he's also kind of maroon. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. I'm at a I'm at a I'm at a uh. uh I'm at a, like a standstill here. You know? I think we'll do this. This color here. We'll just put this maroon here. Yeah, we'll, just, we'll put this maroon here. We'll do, we'll do this color. Why not? I'm. Let's look at other variations of, of, of Gengar. It, it varies. I'm looking at uh, different kinds of Gengar, and they're like either purple or maroon. It depends. It depends on like, it basically it depends on the artist, really. You know? So I'm, I'm just going to go... I'm going to go with this color for now, and I can always change it. I, I just kind of... Uh, I keep like... I'm like flip-flopping, man. I'm going back and forth. I can't decide what color I want to use. For my my uh my character here, I keep um changing my my attitude on 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 them. Like ah, uh, this can this could work, and then all of a sudden, like I look at other ones, like uh, I don't know. But I can always change it. Um, later, <clears throat> I was thinking about my my um my other drawing yesterday or from yesterday, and I was like, you know what? I think I might recolor my my um my Bulbasaur um, <clears throat> because of just because I, I feel like I need to recolor it. Uh, I might leave some of it, you know, there, but I think it needs to be changed because I got the ink done and the way that I inked the drawing has changed the, like the context. It's changed how I viewed the the drawing it's changed how i'm going to approach it um don't tell me okay what's happening here okay it's changed how i viewed the character and it's gonna and because i've i've i put all the ink brushes there it's gonna it's changed how i'm uh going to execute the approach with my uh adding color and i think i need to do that um so what I've learned is don't start coloring until you got your line work done. You know, I thought I can kind of go back and forth, um, but like it's going to, it's, it's, it's changed my, my thought process and the, the, my attitude on what I'm going to do next. And I didn't want to do that, but I guess I got to do it to kind of, move forward with the drawing i didn't want to don't get me wrong i didn't want to change that i didn't want to have to go back and recolor it but i think i'm going to have to do that and it's just what it is you know and you just got to learn to deal with it 
so I've been thinking about this. I've been thinking like maybe that's what I need to do. Like I, with with um with my uh, drawing strategy, maybe I need to focus on like on what I need to improve. Like maybe it's got to be all week is anatomy. Um, like all week is like basic shapes, perspective or something like like. Maybe one one day is like just simple structure uh, studies, right? Where I just play around, and then another day is like creativity studies, where I where I do simple cartoons of stuff. I don't know. I don't know. I I need to really think about this, and and do some research and see what other people do uh, to kind of get going. And then like one one or two days out of the week, I do. I work on these things, you know, maybe, maybe, uh, on certain days of the week that I have more time that I can sit down and do like a longer format drawing where I could spend a couple hours on it, you know, and that might have to be <clears throat> like a weekend, certain weekends. And so, like, for me personally, it would have to be like, it could be Saturday, it could be Sunday and Thursday that I could do a, like a longer format drawing. I think that is where I stand is I could do those. I could really focus on that. I don't know. I don't know, man. So many questions that I don't know about, man. All oh, right, man. Tell you what, this is this is something else. I'm uh, I'm liking I'm liking this one. I like how this drawing turned out, you know. Um, and I think it's got it's got potential to be very good. Um, I'm gonna be looking into. I got lots of ideas and um, plans for the future. Actually, I don't. I don't have any plans for the future. Let me drink some coffee here, like um. I got a lot to ponder regarding my live streams for the future. I got a lot to ponder and um, perhaps in, in this pondering, I will, uh, there will be some like an epiphany st stage. Like an, I, I just like, like, you know, a light bulb just appears upon up over my head. I'm like, Oh my gosh, this makes sense. Um, I'm just hoping that happens sometime in the future. And we'll see. Who knows? We'll see. We will see. There's always room for growth and improvement. Right? And um, there's always room for that. <clears throat> but we'll see. We're well. I always say this. I'm like, oh, I'm. All, we'll see. We'll see what happens. And, and it sounds so like ambiguous. Like I just, it shouldn't be that way. But it is. Is like, uh, I'm the most like clueless guy. Like with everything, I'm just, I'm just <clears throat> always, I'm always like, I'm never sure of everything because I don't know. I'm like, I don't know if it's a bad or good thing because some people like. Like, oh, you're not assertive. Like, well, I am. Like, I'm I, I, clearly I'm assertive because I've done this for 362 days. But like, I'm also, I'm never quite sure of things. Like, what's with the like? I'm I'm always in like a confused, no, not, or or like a perplexed. Maybe I'm perplexed when I. When I come across people that are very confident and, and just like know how to make decisions and I do make decisions, don't get me wrong. I make a decision with this, with, with this artwork, but like to, to make a decision, right. is always, it's a weird thing because there's always repercussions to those decisions. I don't know where I was going with this because I was I was just thinking about like what I need to do with this live stream, and 
sometimes I overthink it and I worried that the overthinking is leaving behind possibilities. And so I'm, I don't think that I'm leaving behind possibilities because I'm still moving along with the live stream. It's still moving forward, <clears throat> right? It's still moving forward. And some people will, um, <clears throat> will do live streams, but they won't do, they, 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 uh, <clears throat> omit possibilities because they're not trying to think about possible like new ways of going about their work their work and so that's what i'm trying to do is like how what what's a, a way that i can go move further move forward in these in these live streams like what do i need to be doing to be correct, progressing forward, like with the content, like what should be done differently. And I'm always looking at ways. Um, and that's why I did the, the whole clouds for a while. And then I was like, you know what? The clouds, the cloud thing isn't really working. Let's, let's do something else. And I tried landscapes for a while and I was like, you know, it's, it's, it's not working in the way that I intended. So let's, let's do something different. And then that's where I, what I led to doing like figure, figure drawing studies. And I was like, well, I don't know if I want to do that every day. Um, so I thought I always liked, always enjoyed doing Pokemon drawings. So let's see how that this pans out. Like let's give Pokemon drawings a, a, um, a go, right. Let's give, let's give them some, um, some drawing time. And so that's what I did is I, um, I uh, moved forward with that idea, and so far, so good. Uh, it's been all good, but there's all, it's also been rot. Is it rot? Is rot a word? Um, it's been it's had some challenges. You know, there had there's been some challenges with it regarding it, and it, it hasn't been completely uh, painless, right? There's, there's been some challenges that have come from doing these live streams. Um, and at one point, I, I was just, when I was doing the cactuses, at least I knew what I was getting into. Like every day was going to be cactus. But the thing about doing those cactuses, I, I, like I like doing them, but like I don't think it, doing those cactuses were in that style was going to make me a better artist. It was going to make me a, a more consistent artist at make at doing one thing, but I don't think it was le lining me up to improve in multiple genres or multiple fields of art. And that's what I wanted to do. Is like I wanted to be able to do artwork that um, that progressed me in in multiple areas, multiple genres. So like I I wasn't just improving in creating a creating so i wasn't just improving at drawing cactuses you know i was improving everywhere and that's what i felt like wasn't happening i wasn't really improving in multiple fields or multiple like areas of development i was just improving in, in a very specialized manner and i don't want that i want to be a little bit more like if i was going to improve in a specialized manner to be portrait making um so maybe that might be something i do maybe i um spend a lot of my time focused on the figure and and then doing some basic stuff so maybe like maybe i'll maybe it's anatomy you know specific anatomy that i'm feeling like i'm really weak at i don't know i gotta sit down and really ponder it or maybe like there's a numbers goal like so maybe do like a hundred riley heads or a thousand I got lots and lots to think about regarding um, this the, the the pathway of this this live stream. I really do, and I've been it's been something that's been on my head on my mind for a while. I'm just trying to think about like what would be a great a a, um, a pathway, and maybe I'll just like maybe I'll just I'll just set up a a um, so there we go. <clears throat>
And so maybe what I'll, what I'll do is I'll just have like a, a um, three days will be like figure work, you know, and I'll just like, it'll be random. Like maybe three, like two of those days will be, I don't know. Uh, like, like, like I'll, I'll, maybe I'll like set up a, a, uh, like pull out like a number system where I pull out a number and then like, Oh, today I'm working on feet or pull out a number. Like today I'm working on the man, uh, the, the face, you know? Uh, so it might be random or maybe two days. Uh, I'll like one day I'll work on the, the face, like the, the st- like work on studying the face and head. And then the other day I'll work on just doing figures. And then one day will be like, um, uh, what would you call it? Wild card. And then the other days will be like practicing perspective and um, doing basic stuff. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to sit down and really think about this and really come up with a plan and just go with it. Right. Let's come up with a, a, a plan and just kind of move from there. Right. So that's what I've got to, I got to do is I got to really come up with, I have to have, I have to have a plan and I'm going to, I'm getting closer and closer to that. But like in at the same light, like I feel like there's not enough time. So like maybe on certain days, um, on certain days I'll, um, I'll have the, on the days I have longer, I can do longer live streams. Maybe like those live streams will be like an hour. I can um, do more. Those are going to be like the heavier study sessions, or they might be the 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 study the sessions that I can um, I can do like these longer format drawings, so I can like work on a Pokemon for a longer session. I don't know. I got to sit down and think about it. I got to really sit down and think about it. I really do. Um, we'll. I'm gonna. It's it's just something to kind of go about uh, to kind of ponder. And we'll, we'll get there. Just, I wish I could get there faster, you know? So we're just going to add white here. I don't know where, um, the thing about having these like scratchy lines that you could see, like all these scratchy lines, it's it's hard to determine where the where I should, where the color should change, you know, and so that's what I'm struggling with. Like where sh- where should I uh, leave the color, and where should I um, not leave the color, or uh, erase, you know, and so that's what I'm pondering. If you have any suggestions on what I need to be doing to improve, like what what areas do I sh- should I like be doing like uh, I don't know I don't know maybe maybe I don't know we'll think about it we'll think about it we will think about it I got lots I'll think about it for a little bit and then I'll write down a plan and I'll do that plan for a while and if it doesn't work out then it doesn't work out but at least I did something Right. And that's really what matters is if you're if you're worried about doing if you're worried about. um, Whether it's going to be the wrong choice, you're in the wrong you're in the wrong field. Right. And let's go here. And I think I'm done for today. It's um day three sixty two, and that is it. So so far so good. I hope you enjoyed today's live art stream. And uh, if you have not already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. It is greatly appreciated. And I just want to say thank you so much for stopping by, and I hope you enjoyed the time that we had together. And I hope to see you again on my next live art stream. 
And as always, have a wonderful day. This is Pearson. I am the number one live art streamer in the world. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Cheers. Bye.